Give thanks with a grateful heart. Give thanks to the Holy One. Give thanks because he's given us Jesus, his Son. Dear Heavenly Father, we do give you grateful thanks this morning for Jesus and for all that he accomplished for us on the cross. Lord, would you help us to understand it more, to take it in, that all that Jesus did for us on the cross. And not only, Lord, on the cross, but we thank you, Father, that you raised him from the dead and he ascended back into heaven. And he is now seated at your right hand, interceding for us, Lord, for when we get it wrong and make mistakes. We thank you for sending your Holy Spirit, who is there to comfort us, and Lord, to give us the right words to say when we can't find the right ones. Lord, the Holy Spirit can take our, our thoughts and our words and put them all into the right order and present them to Jesus. You can, Lord, bring them before your throne. And Father, we not only thank you for all that was accomplished on the cross, but we thank you too for all that you provide for us day by day. For the homes we have to live in. For the food that we always have on our tables. For our health and strength. And for everything else, Lord, that you provide for us. We do indeed, Lord, thank you for one another and the fellowship that we can share with one another because we share fellowship with you. So, Heavenly Father, we do ask that you would accept our thanks this morning whilst they do come from the bottom of the hearts, even though, Lord, we feel that they are inadequate for all that you have done for us. Lord, how can we ever thank you enough for all that you've done for us? But Lord, it is in and through the name of your wonderful Son, Jesus, that we bring our thanks to you this morning. And just thank you, Lord, for all that you have done for us and are going to do for us. Lord, that uh, we are forever in your thoughts. and Lord, you have your eye upon us every day. You know the future, Lord. You know what it holds for us. Lord, we bring our future and place it into your hands. We know not what the future holds, but we know that you do hold the future, Lord. And we give you a grateful thanks and know that one day we'll be able to look you face to face and say thank you. So, Father, we just ask that you'll accept our thanks now in and through the wonderful name of your Son, Jesus. Amen.